The Persian cat is a long-haired breed of cat characterized by its round face and short muzzle. It's also known as the Persian long hair in English-speaking countries. The first documented ancestors of the Persian were imported into Italy from Iran, historically known as Persia in the West, around the year 1620. It was developed first by the English and then mainly by American breeders after the Second World War. The selective breeding carried out by breeders has allowed the development of a wide variety of coat colors, but has also led to the creation of increasingly flat-faced Persians favored by many people. Persian cats can live to about 10 to 17 years in captivity and usually have a weight range of around 7 to 12 pounds. Easily recognizable for their long, luxurious coats and big, expressive eyes, Persians are one of the most popular cat breeds in the world. With their snub noses, chubby cheeks, and long hair, the Persian cat is quite exquisite. They have a large round head, large round eyes, a short nose, full cheeks, and small ears with rounded tips. The head is supported by a short thick neck and a deceptively sturdy muscular body. A Persian's legs are short, thick, and strong with large round firm paws. The tail is short but proportional to the length of the cat's body. A long, thick, shiny coat with a fine texture completes the Persian cat's look. It's long all over the body and includes an immense ruff around the neck, a deep frill between the front legs, long ear and toe tufts, and a full brush or tail. Persians can come in different looks. Some have an extremely flat face. Through past selective breeding, cat fanciers began to mold the Persian into its present day appearance. Persians are typically quiet and affectionate cats who enjoy being held, but they're content just lounging around too. Just like their name says, Persian cats probably did come from Persia. The exact origins of the Persian cat are obscure, but they came to the attention of Europeans when diplomats stationed in the Middle East brought the first long-haired cats back to England and other European countries in the mid-1800s. These were immediately prized for their exotic looks and named for their presumed homelands. Two of the best-known Persians were from Iran, the seat of the ancient Persian Empire, and Angora's name for Ankara in Turkey. These long-haired beauties were an immediate hit with Westerners. The Persian is an old breed, to those who love this elegant cat, it will come as no surprise that the long-haired beauty originated in the cradle of civilization, Mesopotamia, which was later known as Persia and is now modern-day Iran. The breed's long hair was probably the result of a natural mutation, and its striking appearance attracted the attention of 17th-century Italian nobleman and world traveler Pietro della Valle, who is credited with bringing the first long-haired cats to Europe in 1626. Persian cats have an old-school pedigree. Purebred cats closely followed the creation of the first kennel clubs in Europe in the mid-19th century. The world's first cat show was held in London's Crystal Palace in 1871, and the first purebred Persians arrived in the United States around 1875. The rise of cat breeding houses on both sides of the Atlantic at the turn of the 20th century was largely driven by the popularity of the Persian considered one of the earliest pedigreed cats. Until the late 19th century, when breeding and showing cats became popular, long-haired cats from Persia, Turkey, Afghanistan, and other exotic locales were known simply as Asiatic cats and were often bred together. At the Crystal Palace Cat Show in 1871, Persian-type cats were among the breeds exhibited. They were popular pets of the time and had a special cachet because of Queen Victoria's fondness of the breed. Even in the Victoria era, association with a celebrity ensured an animal's desirability. In the United States, where they were first imported in the 19th century, they also became favorites, edging out the long-haired Maine Coon Cat, which had once held pride of place as an American sweetheart. In little more than a century since, the Persian has become the most beloved cat breed in the world,
prized for its beautiful appearance and sweet personality. And that hair. Persians have long, thick coats with individual hairs four to six inches in length. The colors of their coat run the full spectrum from solid snowy white to wild, multi-tone combinations of tabby, tortoise shell, patches, and more. In the past, Persian cats had shiny, silky gray fur, but thanks to selective breeding, Persians are now found in a kaleidoscope of colors. Their coats are a real rainbow of cat colors. There are seven different categories of Persians: solid, silver and golden, smoke and shaded, tabby, particolor, bicolor, and Himalayan. But within those seven categories are a near endless combination of hair colors and patterns: chocolate, red, blue, lilac, cream, tortoise shell, tabby, calico, and others like white, blue, black, and blue shaded silver or golden. And then there are the shaded, smoke, particolor, and bicolor divisions. That's not counting the various patterns of the Himalayan. If you breed certain varieties of Persians, the kittens are capable of producing 30 different color combinations. Eye color is related to coat color. For instance, white Persians have deep blue or brilliant copper eyes. Other solid color Persians have brilliant copper eyes. Silver and golden Persians have green or blue-green eyes, and so on. Then there's the face. Unlike Egyptian or Siamese cats with long, sleek noses, Persians have flat, open faces with tiny button noses. Their richly colored eyes, close set against the wee nose, look extra big and expressive. The curved, pansy shape of their cheeks accentuates their small, triangular noses. Persians are friendly but lazy too. The dignified Persian is known for being quiet. She's an ornament to any home where she can enjoy sitting in someone's lap. Persians are affectionate but discriminating. They reserve their attention for family members and those few guests with whom they feel they can trust. Persians are popular for more than their good looks. They're also extremely friendly for a cat. Most cats are affectionate on their own terms, but Persian cats do things that normal cats just don't do. Persians will run to the door to greet visitors and even come when they're called by name. Persians are also known to be talkative, chatting with their owners in a sing-songy meow. But don't get the idea that Persians are overly active animals. They are the laziest breed in the world. They can literally sleep 20 hours a day. Even their kittens don't play very much, but that's just fine with Persian fans. Their laid-back, lap-napping style means that Persians are less likely to hop up on counters and rummage through cabinets searching for food. Although Persians tend to be relaxed and easygoing, they also command an air of royalty. They may not be quick to hiss or scratch, but that doesn't mean they won't become annoyed when bothered by loud children or pets. Persians aren't the best choice for a house full of boisterous children or dogs, but they have no objection to being the object of a gentle child's attentions or getting along with a friendly dog who doesn't chase them or otherwise cause them anxiety. Loud environments aren't a Persian's style. They are sedate cats who prefer a serene home where little changes from day to day. Persians let their simple needs be known: regular meals. A little playtime with a feather teaser, and lots of love, which they return tenfold. This is one cat who is unlikely to climb up your curtains, jump on your kitchen counters, or perch on top of your refrigerator. She's perfectly happy to rule her domain from the floor or more accessible piece of furniture. When you're at work or busy around the house. The Persian is content to sit in a chair, sofa, or bed until you are free to admire her and give her the attention she willingly receives but never demands. Their coats need a lot of care. Persians might be laid back, but their fur is famously high maintenance. If you're going to buy a long-haired breed like a Persian, expect to comb its hair every single day. Cats are notoriously crafty, wily, and smart. That being said, Persian cats really aren't that bright, or let's just say, 
They're just a little slower to reach developmental milestones than other breeds of cats. Even at eight weeks old, they'll have kittens who still haven't figured out how to use the litter box. On top of that, Persians just aren't natural predators and hunters. You won't normally see them chasing mice or showing any interest in chasing critters. But all in all, those who treat the Persian cat with the dignity and gentleness they deserve will be rewarded with an affectionate lap cat who enjoys a good petting or even a brush through the hair. If you want a best friend who will return all your dedication and love in kind, the Persian might just be the right feline for you.